Hi, Dr. De Pasquale at NSI, and we treat orthopedic conditions quite often. And when we talk about orthopedic or joint-related problems, most patients come to see us because of the pain that they experience. Um, they come here once the pain gets to a certain point, and it obviously affects the quality of their life. I get that. But the most important thing to understand and why stem cell therapy or regenerative medicine is really a very powerful tool is because we don't just wanna deal with symptoms, we wanna affect the cause of those symptoms. So the most common things we see with, let's say, shoulder issues are osteoarthritic or damage to the cartilage surfaces, and those are more chronic conditions where we get wear and tear over a long period of time, but we can also affect the rotator cuff muscles, because in a lot of cases we see things like sports injuries or car accidents where we tear some of those rotator cuff muscles. In any case, we can repair and regenerate tissue using stem cell therapy and some of the other regenerative medicine tools that we have at our disposal. And why that's important is because it provides a long-term solution. So let's take a look at what we're talking about from an, from an arthritic standpoint. When we have a normal shoulder joint, this is the ball and socket joint, and you can see that they're covered by cartilage surfaces, and those cartilage surfaces fit together and allow the joint to glide and move normally. So when you look at it, that surface is really an important part of the puzzle. In a normal setting, we obviously don't have any pain and we can function normally. Over time, as a result of the repetitive stress process, what we see is that cartilage surface starts to wear away. Now, as you can imagine, when you move your shoulder, this creates irritation, inflammation, and pain patterns but those are not the problem. The problem is the damaged tissue. Now, as you can imagine, I'm showing you cartilage, but remember that there's lots of musculature here as well. And the shoulder, it's a really muscular joint. It's a really important that we take care of those uh, structures as well if we're gonna have a long-term positive outcome. But in this case, what we do is we repair this cartilage surface. And in the meantime, or at the same time, what we do is we make sure that we take care of, care of all the musculature so that we can promote better function reduce pain and a better outcome long-term. And that's really the difference in this environment. It's not that we don't care about symptoms, it's just that we don't mask symptoms because eventually that's gonna wear off and lead to really long-term uh, disability and more pain patterns going forward and ultimately surgery. Um, if our goal is to prevent surgery, if our goal is to reduce pain long-term and improve function, get you back to doing the things that you really enjoy, then we have to affect the cause. And that's what we do here.